Hi there, and welcome to The Dow Show for Monday, April 9th, 2018. I'm Ferris Fair. And I'm Bambi Dextrous. And we have so many videos up on the channel from this week. It was a very busy weekend here, yet again in Edmonton. Um, on Saturday, the uh, Imperial Sovereign Court of the Wild Bros had um, a, an event at the Edmonton Inn and Conference Center. Uh, Rain 42 presents Are You Smarter Than a Drag Queen? Uh, hosted by Harvey Steele and Davina Dyfor. Uh, you were at that event. What did you think of the show? Um, it was really fun. They had some games and they had a game show that I was lucky okay. enough to be a part of. Um, there were a couple of numbers that stood out to me. Uh, Call N Bay and No Vagina did a duet, I Drove All Night. Mm -hmm. And another one that stood out to me was Trailer Park Trash, I Want a Bear. Uh, those were good. Uh, yeah, that was a neat mix from Trey. And uh, I really liked that version of the song. I, I, I mean, I'm a big fan of I Drove All Night from Cindy, but uh, yeah, that was a good version. Um, the, other, the other ones that I uh, have to mention were um, China White, so good to have you back in town again. Uh, to me, uh, you, you remind me quite a bit of uh, Bianca Lovegood, who's one of my favorites. So uh, since Bianca's not around, hey, why don't you move? <laughs> Come join us more. Um, the other one that I have to talk about is Davina Die For. Um, she did, um, she just did a fabulous number. And I, I have to believe that she, like, I assume she knew her words. Um, she didn't really end up saying a whole lot of them because she was too busy eating. Huh. <laughs> uh, somebody tipped her with vegan pizza and yeah, anyway, it was adorable. Uh, but yeah, fabulous number. Fabulous number. Uh, so yeah, it looked like it was a really good show. So check out all those videos on Dragging Our Heels. Oh, I gotta take this off. I can't handle it. Ugh. Whew, so much better. Mask reveal. Now I can, yes, yes reveal. Queen. Oh my goodness. Um, Sunday, we, as usual, went to the uh, Sunday mm -hmm. Review. It was a very special episode, um, hosted by Chelsea Horrendous, Church of Satin 3. Uh, Chelsea was fabulous. She put a great cast together, and um, I thought she did a really good job hosting, and, and I haven't seen her uh, do it for a while, and she was really having a lot of fun and playing with the audience, and uh, yeah, uh, great job all around. And then... Uh, did a couple of group numbers. Oh with, yes, with the group numbers with some of the backup. With a bunch Tell of us about that. Well, they were just so good. I mean, Twiggy's always a star. She just is. Yeah, she's so good in everything mm -hmm. she does. But yeah, it was Twiggy and Jean Benet Ramsey and Indigo and Science Fair. Uh, I call them the Satan, uh, the Satanists, I believe, on the on the <laughs> channel. So you can look for those videos there. But yeah, uh, just some good, great uh, opening numbers and uh, for each of the sets. And yeah, really great. And then. Uh, Oh, trigger warning. Girl, she did she did this number, um, Start Wearing Purple, um, which mm, you all Chelsea, know. Chelsea, Start Wearing and, Purple. And yeah, uh, bitch stapled $10 bills to herself all over, including her forehead, and I was just sitting there like in this fetal position watching the entire number, just like, oh my god, oh my god, this is happening, oh my god. I wasn't protected from hiding behind the camera because Bambi was filming. Yeah. So yeah, like, it was just such a... Disgusting, horrible, number. wonderful, perfectly Chelsea horrendous number. Anyway, good God. I'm traumatized. That's a perfect segue. Speaking of traumatized, Speaking of traumatized. one of the numbers that I want to discuss today on the show was John Bonet, Poop on Me. Uh, poop, poop on me later. Poop on me later. <laughs> from uh, so, Smooth Operator from Shadow. Uh, yes. Oh my god, can we just start a playlist of poop related songs by JBR? Like, please. the shit list. <laughs> uh, girl, you know I love you. And that one was just like conceptual and fun, but. And gross. <laughs> yes, yes, it was so good. It's so good. Um, and and honestly, you may have even outdone it with fitness, because fitness was so good too. Uh, like, yes, fitness. Um, yeah, like. Uh, you found drops. a way. You found a way to incorporate those drops and like landed into like the stretch. Like a stretch. So good. Position. So good. Nicely done. Nicely done. Um, the other big one that I really have to talk about is both of the Lordus numbers. Oh, yeah. I, I loved both of them, hun. Uh, they were so good. Uh, the Faye Denaway number was yeah timely, but I mean so good. Um, just absolutely nailed it. And you were just a silhouette of wonderfulness in in. Um, in the other number, um, all uh, and I remember every kiss. It was just gorgeous. It was a gorgeous number. So uh, yeah. I'm super excited for what you're going to bring to the table on Friday. 
that was that was Sunday. Um, we do have a few more videos, surprise, coming up in the next day or two. We actually have some videos from Vancouver Coronation Out of Town show. Oh my we goodness. haven't talked about it, but it, it actually happened a couple weeks ago, but those are coming up right away. We finally got the footage last night, so they are going up at, hopefully in the next couple of days. Oh, perfect. Right so on. that's exciting. But that was everything from last week. This is what we've got coming up this weekend. Ugh! Better. Another reveal! Reveal! I'm actually not wearing any makeup. Neither am I. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, on Thursday, as usual, Evolution Wonder Lounge is hosting their Drag Race viewing party for Season 10 of RuPaul's Drag Race. So uh, meet us there at 6 o'clock and watch it with us. We always have a really good time with that. Mm -hmm. um, yes, RuPaul. Uh, uh, stick around if you'd like afterwards for the karaoke finale. I uh, made it through, so I would love to see some people out supporting. Um, Friday! They're finally at the semi-finals for uh, Alberta's Next Drag Superstar. I'm so excited. How excited! I'm so excited. There are ten queens, five from each prelim, that are going to be there. Um, from the first prelim, we got Kat Marlowe Minora, mm -hmm. John Benet Ransme, No Vagina, Andrew Ginny, and Rexy Resurrection. That's awesome. And uh, who else from the second prelim? From prelims? the second prelim, we have Ivy League, Go Go Fetch, Pheromone Kills, uh, Lourdes the Merry Virgin beat Gigi to uh, get the um, wild fourth card. spot, and then the wild card from that one was for Sapphire. So uh, yeah. that's the ten. It's going to be a fantastic show. I'm super excited to see what they are going to bring to the table. So excited to see what they're going to bring. Yay! Uh, so that's Sunday. That's, that's Friday. Friday. Uh, we don't even know what day it is. Uh, on Saturday. Manila Luzon is coming to town to celebrate her wedding tour and Evolution Wonder Lounge uh, is putting that on. Uh, doors are at 9, uh, tickets are still on sale but they are going fast. They are going fast. So, so if you gotta get your tickets fast. Speaking of which, I think you need one still so we yeah. should probably get on that too. Hey Evolution, save me a ticket. <laughs> I'll get one tonight. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's going to be a fantastic show. We, uh, Roselle Christina, if not the Queens of the Orient 2.0 are, are opening. Uh, Melinda Verga, uh, Pheromone Kills. It's going to be a great show. So I'm super excited to see Manila again. We met her a couple of years ago at RuPaul Bots. And, uh, Just so lovely. Yeah. Wonderful human being. And, and really one of our one of our favorites. So uh, we're going to be out celebrating a friend's birthday that night too. So we're going to be up to all kinds of shenanigans. So look for us there. It's going to be a fantastic Yay. night. Um, on Sunday, it's a bit of a busy day. Um, of course, we'll be going to the Sunday review. But is there anything I should perhaps think of doing earlier than the, in the day? Oh, for sure. Earlier in the Sunday, we've got the Queen's Brunch happening at the Villa Casino. Yeah. It's hosted by Sister Mary Clarence, and it's stacked with performers. We got the, the lovely Godiva, mm -hmm. Tequila Mockingbird, Lay Away. Mm -hmm. We have a drag king, Dixon Cunts, is yes. in the show. And then there's me, Bambi Dextrous. Yay! Uh, as she said, also hosted by Sister Mary Clarence, so she'll be performing too, and it's going to be uh, a really good time. We were there last month and had uh, had a great time, so we're excited to go this time. We're taking the camera, so we'll actually record it this time. And uh, yeah, if you're looking for something to do on Sunday, why don't you head down and join us there? Um, Sunday evening, as I mentioned, is of course the Sunday Review. Uh, this one is hosted by Andrew Ginny. It's uh, listed on Facebook as the Kink Review, uh, but the actual title is Andra's Bloody Fetish Ball. Oh my goodness. I'm not sure what the other ball is, but that one is apparently a bloody <laughs> fetish one. Uh, shows at uh, 10, of course, uh, Doors at 9, uh, some of the fabulous performers, Christy Healy, Poca Want This, and Lourdes the Merry Virgin. It's going to be a really good show. Um, Superb. So those are all the things you'll see dragging our heels at. So that's right. Videos from. We will be there. Um, one last thing on the following Tuesday, the 17th, I think, um, is the monthly annual meeting of the uh, Imperial Solver and Court of the Wild Rose. So uh, if you want to uh, check out that meeting, you can find that link on their website, I'm sure. And uh, yeah, that's at the Edmonton Inn and Conference Center at, I think, 7 o'clock. Do we have any favorites of the week we want to discuss? Uh, yes. 
the one that I really, 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 really well, I, uh, there was a few. Uh, I think, I think, I'm trying to debate. Honestly, it's between the two Lourdes ones. Um, uh, 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 Faye Dunaway. Yeah, the, the Oscar one, the best picture one. Best picture. Yeah, is what I labeled it as. Uh, but yeah, that was that was yes. probably. Uh, yeah, I, I honestly, I'm probably, I'm never going to forget the staple gun. But the staple but, gun was very good. Oh, that's but so cool. I'm never going to forget favorite. the staple gun. But sorry, go. Do I go with staple gun or do I go with poop humor? Oh, the my choices. pick of the week is going to be poo on me later. <laughs> That's John Benny Ramsey, <laughs> Join me later. As usual, thank you so much for watching. We have all those videos up on our channel now. There are more coming this week, as I said. Yay! Check out this week's favorites. I'm Bambi Dextrous. I'm Ferris Fair. Thanks for watching. Bye! Bye.